number one show that dominates cable news, The O'Reilly Factor. Now, in the Netherlands, perhaps the most liberal European country, the government is now shutting down pot shops and legalized brothels. Apparently, organized crime is controlling both over there. It, it hasn't worked in Holland. They had really wonderfully naive ideas about teaching their children to have safe sex and smoke grass. And what's happened is all the criminals and drug addicts throughout Europe have gone and exploited that opening in Amsterdam. It's absolutely run out of control, completely run amok. It's not going to work here. Amsterdam is a mess. My friend is a former Dutch... In the Netherlands, their experimentation with social tolerance, free love, free drugs, clearly has backfired. Amsterdam is a cesspool of corruption, crime. Everything's out of control. It's anarchy. As you point out... I responded from Amsterdam to a false report by Fox News about the cesspool of crime and corruption our city was supposed to be. Over in Holland, it's a disaster. After the media and online discussion boards talked about the video, the self-proclaimed fair, balanced and accurate news channel felt compelled to respond. Hi, Sam Wiz. I'm Bill O'Reilly in the Culture Warrior segment tonight. You may remember we reported on Amsterdam, Holland last December. The picture we painted of Amsterdam was of a permissive city. But, of course, the left doesn't see it that way. Now, in his response, O'Reilly continues to paint a scary picture of Amsterdam using amusing one-liners. Carefully here. Every uh, questionable person in Europe heads to Amsterdam because it's all there right. in a two square mile deal and their friends are there. It's a Disney World for those people. Who are you talking about, Bill? It's definitely safe. I haven't seen any crime. You don't even see any police out here. I'm traveling here by myself. I'm a female traveling by myself and I feel very safe. Highly encourage Americans to come over and visit this place. A lot of history, a lot of culture. Back to Fox, where one of the ladies is finally allowed to point to my facts. 40% of people in the USA compared to 22.6% in the Netherlands. The way they the do the statistics in the Netherlands is different, plus it's a much smaller Look, country. We're not There's being... a much smaller base to do the stats on. Come on, Bill. Statistics are relative. It's real easy. The point is, the Dutch society, which offers more personal freedom to its people, doesn't seem to experience more crime or drug problems. Any final thoughts? I don't even care what happens in the Netherlands. Come again? I don't even care what happens in the Netherlands. What I'm saying to everybody is, this is coming here to the United States. It's coming. It's coming. It's coming. All of this liberation. Disney World for those people. Fox News Channel. Fair, balanced, and accurate reporting.